All right, so we're checking out the only game where you get paid to destroy the environment. It's Recycle Garbage Truck Simulator. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boys here, the T-1000 Duo. I really don't know why this game creates this lighting infrastructure as it has, where your men appear to be like robotic, metallic versions of themselves. But this is our glorious duo that will be piloting the various objects that we have. I ain't no low-class garbage man, all right? I got $5 million. We're gonna go buy some crap over to the management area, damn it. Route license. Uh, give me all of them. <laughs> what the hell was that achievement music? <laughs> did I just complete an achievement or did I just complete an adult film? I was going to buy all these until I realized just how many there are. Oh my god. You always want to have plenty of places to take a dump, I guess. So, uh, sure. Can you rename these? Damn it. I'm not saying 100% that I would give these inappropriate names. I'm just saying that I would do better than like Park Avenue 1 and Park Avenue 2. All right, Shady Place, Park Square. Oh, by the way, in case you guys are wondering, the city that we're in is called Wasteville. Uh, so I need nine dumpsters. Highway lane? Isn't both a highway and a lane a designation of a type of roadway? So isn't this basically just duplicating something? Oh, uh, what am I talking about? It's a simulation game. These things do whatever the hell they want anyway. Supposedly, you can get a bunch of these vehicles to do things. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh man, you got big garbage trucks and organic garbage trucks and garbage crane trucks. Yeah, I want all this. Oh yeah, how you like me now? Things are starting to look pretty legit. I think you can put these on autopilot and the game will like do a lot of this for you. Oh damn, you can buy all the different buildings like the biogas plant and the incinerator. Whatever, I want all this. Achievement unlocked, burn them. <laughs> oh my God, this achievement music is the best. Oh my God, you can upgrade the different freaking buildings. Absolutely. freaking lootly all right, I've got a big ass garbage truck. I've got three strapping young men ready to make some money. Everyone get on the damn back of the truck. Never mind. apparently you can't yet. I gotta be out in the roadway. That seems safe. Here, now that I'm out in the roadway, will you get out? Good. Step on out there, buddy. You don't get to ride in the cab with air conditioning. I'm gonna put both of them back there. We're gonna dual wield guys, basically. And now it's time to go make stacks of cash by grabbing people's fecal material and throwing it into the back of the truck. I know what you're asking yourself, but Gray, are there any collision <laughs> Apparently there's red light offenses. No, there is not collision at all. Well, there is kind of collision, just not real collision. Ma'am, do not get too close to the garbage truck. Thank you very much. All right, now supposedly all you got to do is go to the... <laughs> Man, it's a good thing I have a bunch of money because I am never going to stop at a red light. I don't care how many fines I get. But anyway, we have to go to our very first... Jesus! What is every single light red? How about this one? Am I gonna... Is this one red as well? No, apparently not. We got to go to our very first garbage pickup area and start throwing everything in the back of the truck. I guess we have to go to a, like a landfill or something like that afterwards. I'll oh, suck at red lights. All right, there's our very first garbage chunk. How do you get it? Let me go ahead and just run these guys into it. I want them nice and close. All right, boys, go grab it. You're just going to watch them? You can get out there and help too, or do I need to move for this? You gonna bring it into the truck or what? What are we doing here? Bring dumpster to truck. There we go. Get that get them biceps working. Fantastic. Oh yeah, there we go. I don't know what the hell happened. It's like when I was using the the three guy truck, it did the, the, the game didn't want it to work. I don't know why. I, you gotta understand, man. Th these aren't exactly AAA games, and I don't exactly play them the right way. Where the hell are you going? Just put it back where you found it. We're not taking the damn dumpster with us. As a matter of fact, you don't get to come back inside of the cab. G stand on the back. Nothing like 479 kilograms of generic trash. I don't know how you get the better trash. I guess there's, like, glass and recyclables as well. I'm just gonna mess with this first, and then we'll see if we can get the other trash types. All right, I think I missed my turn, so we're just gonna go through these people's yards this guy in the back of the of the the garbage truck has to be thinking that his life is going to end at any time like we're going off road we're cutting traffic off we're running red lights <laughs> see what you gotta do is drive you drive over here and then you hit slam on the parking brake all right the parking brake did not work at all all right so real quick what happens if you try and take off while he's <laughs> you gonna chase after me with the dumpster or are you just gonna stand there you're just gonna stand there how far away can i make you come that's right come on buddy come on 
There you go. Nope, nope. A little bit further. A little bit further. Come on. Yep, a little further than that. Can I get him to go like all the way down the end of the street? Like, is there a limit to how far the AI will pursue you? Wow. This guy will freaking Rocky Balboa. This gigantic. What happens if I put like cars and stuff in the way? All right, let's see you get through all those obstacles. Eh? Let's see how good you are now. You're just going to phase them right through the front of the car. I'm going to tell you the pathfinding is pretty good in the game, all, all things considered. Good for him. This is why no one ever wants to work for me. This guy's coming over here and he's like, really, Gray? You freaking asshole. <laughs> Listen, garbage men are meant to be in excellent shape. Okay, this is how it happens. Manual labor. Now go ahead and bring it back <laughs> while he's going. Later. <laughs> do you lose a, Do you lose an employee if you just leave him there forever? This guy might never come back. I really don't know. He probably just quit after the very first the very first route. He finally saw what he was in for, and he's like, you know what? I can make more money running the newspaper stand. This is bullshit. Is he actually gone? Because it's. It's been a little while and I still haven't seen him. Hold on. I think he was waiting for a pickup. Hold on. Here, come on. <laughs> Jesus! I just got taken out by a car. How come I'm getting fined for everything and that guy's not getting fined? Anyway, I wanted to see how the landfill works. Go on down into the main landfill area. I think we could just drop our stuff off here. I have to bring the guy back inside first, though. All right, yeah, just step right through the grass and, like, you know, up to your knees in textures. It's fine. What the hell is that sound? What is that sound? I don't know what that sound is just then. Is that the autosave sound? I hope not. All right, now, supposedly, you can press the button, dump the garbage. Just for some reason, you get paid for screwing up the landfill, which is fine. And if you notice, all of our garbage is perfectly compressed in beautiful blocks of sadness so now it should all spill out into the environment slowly seeping its way into the earth pissing off mother nature as it were killing everyone around us and i think that there's a way for us to like get inside of the bulldozer and flatten this stuff i'm really not sure so this is embarrassing i got the truck stuck on my own waist i hadn't really planned it this way it just kind of happened because that's how it goes Pull your ass out of there. You're a big ass garbage truck. Fantastic. Okay. So now it's paper day. Different week is I think I fast forwarded like a month or something like that, but whatever. It's it'll be fine. So I think that this is the appropriate garbage truck to pick up the paper. Uh it's got the super floppy crane on the back. A couple of doses of garbage style Viagra. We should be fine though. There's also an organic truck. I think that I'm still running these damn lights. I think that we can drop the paper off at the incinerator. I if I can figure out where the hell the incinerator is. Landfill Incorporated, our solution for the environment. Is it? Is that the solution? More landfills? I feel like that's not the solution. I'm okay with it because I guess I'm getting paid. Okay, I really don't know how this works. So, oh my god, what a pain in the balls this is. Oh, sh my hook is... No, oh, alright, whatever. I think by now, I've driven through every goddamn red light in this entire area. I got the organic truck because at this point, I don't know what the hell else to use to get this garbage. I now know when I look at everyone, why they're all so depressed inside of Wasteville. I feel depressed in Wasteville and I'm not really a resident. I'm just trying to keep the place clean, not doing a very good job. All right, everyone, I'm here for your organic waste. Oh, I think they finally figured out how to bring stuff out to the frigging side of the road so that the crane thing can pick these up and throw them into the, into the crane chunk garbage truck. I don't know 100% if that's how it works. I'm just kind of assuming. You broke the speed limit. There's a speed limit in this frigging game too? You would think that with all the traffic laws they put in this game. Can you mix the two types of garbage together? Because this is a different type of garbage and I'm about to find out one way or the other, damn it. Workers cannot reach the destination because they are stuck in the truck. Seriously? They don't work because it's raining outside? Are you serious? I'm not sure where it happened. I'm not sure when it happened. I'm not even sure how I did it, but I lost one of my workers. Remember how I asked if you can leave him back when back when you're picking up trash? I think I left that dude all the way back at our other stop. Please tell me you can go off road. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Okay, for right now, I just got to take a guess on where this guy might be. I'm starting to lose sight of what the purpose of this game is besides driving me freaking crazy. Okay, that's a different colored dot. I have a feeling that's probably our guy. Hey, man. Listen, I'm real sorry about that. I know you've been standing out in the rain for the last, oh, six hours? I'm only going to claim partial fault for that. If he really wanted to be inside of the garbage truck, he should have said something. I just saw a sign. It said no right turns. Can I get a traffic citation for making a right turn on the no right turns? I've got one for apparently everything else. Let's give it a shot. Yep. <laughs> you sure can.
<laughs> oh my god. I guess one of the worst things I could possibly do is to dump the waste in the wrong area. I'm sure there's some sort of crazy federal codes for that as well. I wouldn't know, but I just I feel like there would be. I'm gonna go ahead and drive on the sidewalk, um, because something I noticed, if you're not... Uh, where the red light is, uh, it can't ding you for it because technically you're not running the red light. You're running the area around the red light. Thousand dollars on that one for breaking the speed limit. Awesome. All right, maybe now we'll actually pick up some garbage, which is supposed to be the whole point of this game. Let me go ahead and run this last red light over here. Line up next to the organic trash, my organic trash picker upper. Get my guy out. Oh my God, it's happening. It's actually going to work. Here we go. Okay, bring it over to the truck. Mm-hmm. Good. No, no. Where are you going? Yes, yes, come back. There you go. I don't know why the hell you had to do the whole extra lap, but whatever, son of a bitch. Oh, I just earned 500 bucks for the garbage that we had. We didn't really have that much garbage. I just want to get it out of here so I can pick up the other garbage. Yes, fall out in perfect blocks so that you can immediately turn into freakish jagged dirt that will catch on my truck and <laughs> keep me from trying to leave this wretched place. All right, Gray still plays, ramping off the garbage. Here we go. Not too bad. Okay, now that I cleaned out the, the back of the garbage truck, can I finally pick up the organic trash? Bring it here. Don't do the thing that you did before. Stop that. Yes, bring it straight to the truck. There's no reason to get your traps extra workouts or whatever the hell you're trying to do. Yes, it works. Okay, so after we get done here, we have to go to the recycling area. I don't know where that is, but I'm sure it can't be too far. All right, I'm lazy, and I don't feel like parking all the way over there. Go get the damn dumpster. Imagine a workday where, like, until you're done working, it just stays 4 p.m., and it never advances. That's what's happening here. Because we're so far behind, the day just won't go forward. It's just stuck at 1,600 hours. It's like a permanent working hell. Come on, it's only 800 kilograms of paper. Roll that thing over here. I feel like in real life, some poor bastard wouldn't have to roll the gigantic dumpster of paper over here. Oh, the trash teleported into his hands that time. He's just so annoyed at how easy it was that he's going to bring it all the way back over just so we can turn it around and shove it into the ass of our dump of our uh, garbage truck. I always want to call this thing a dump truck. I guess it dumps garbage, but... Okay, so that's the biogas plant. In case anyone was wondering why it always rains in Wasteville, this is basically God continuously crying at the job I'm doing. He's looking down at the lack of garbage man skills, and he he just can't stop himself from weeping giant crocodile theaters all over the city. I don't go on the roads anymore. I'm so afraid of achieving more red light offenses that I always just take the sidewalks now. I think it's safer that way for me. This is like the number one way to pick up women. It just doesn't work because the women don't exist as actual creatures in the game, unfortunately. See, look, I could actually have my guy over here, like, literally hold hands with this lady. If there was any type of collision, even a ragdoll collision would be enough for me. All right, what the hell plant is over on this side? I hope it's the recycling plant because that's what I'm looking for. I just didn't pay attention before. It's green. That's really promising. Son of a It's the incinerator. Can I incinerate this stuff here, there? Survey says no. Ugh, so that means that the recycler is all the way on the other side of town. Is there a speed limit that I'm not supposed to be driving at with a dude hanging off the back of my garbage truck? Because as of right now, we're going like 90 kilometers per hour. Are those flying pig statues on that bridge? Okay, that was a flying pig statue on that bridge. Oh, whatever. Nothing surprises me in this game anymore. Okay, I've made it to the recycling plant, which means that I can finally do what the entire purpose of the game is titled after. Recycle crap. All you gotta do, move over here, park in the glowing red square, and I don't know what to do now. Oh, this is gonna open with this guy sitting in the back? Okay. Wait, that's the compression. I'm pretty sure there was no living creatures in the back of the, uh, the garbage truck when I started this. This guy's been standing out in the rain all day. It's only now that I allowed him to finally come into the truck. Yes, I think it's gonna work. Yes! Oh my god! Finally! Damn, and it's decent money too. 
So what does it look like when our glorious pallets of paper come spilling out into the recycling plant? Is it any different than before? I mean, it's got like a like a leprechaunish green tint, but it's just because the ground's glowing. Damn, that's a lot of stuff. Oh wow, it's just spilling right out into the roadway. Um, do I just leave this there? Do I have to do anything? Or do did did the guys take care of this? I'm gonna go ahead and assume that the employees take care of this. Although technically, since I own this, I guess they're my employees. Bye. Please tell me I can park in here so that my men can finally go home. They've been at work for like 35 hours straight. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Well, I went like 15 days in the future and it's still freaking raining. The Terminator twins did their job. They managed to get the garbage and recycle it. I'd like to mention that every once in a while, the guy on the left is like juggling his balls. You see that right there. I don't know why, but he's definitely fidgeting down there. Let me see if I can kind of get my, my vision to get a better idea. Okay, he's open-handed caressing that area. Whatever. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Recycle. The game I'll probably never, ever play again because I want to keep my sanity. Until the next time, stay foxy and much love.